What's up, everybody? I'm Becca Sapphire, and welcome back to my Morticians Tale. Let's continue. Well, that was a time leap there. Oh, we're gonna have to do a cremation, aren't we? used to be my old teacher's name. Eh, she was a bitch. No. Cremation. It's gonna show, like, how cremation doesn't exactly cremate the entire body, or Oh, if we have to dress those up, then that's gonna be so fucked. Please tell me that's not what this is. Please tell me. Oh, thank you, Lord. Okay. Gotta... Gotta find them in the ashes. Blup. Blup. And the blup. Blup. This is nice in a weird way. She liked that we're all here talking. She always tried to keep her family together. The food is delicious. I know that's weird, but the crab cakes are perfect. I think we'll do maybe two funerals an episode. She would have hated this music. She never wanted her funeral to be sad. Um, she would have wanted her smiling. She said so. Yeah, I think maybe two funerals an episode will work. Maybe? Maybe three. If they're short funerals, then it'll be three. But if it's like long process ones, then it'll be two. Glad she was cremated and not like open casket or something. So you know like that? I don't know if I could have. At least we got to say goodbye. She would have liked that. Okay, I actually have a story about a family member that was cremated. Fair warning, it's slightly horrific. When my grandmother on my mom's side died, we cremated her because her last wish was to be part of the sea. She always loved the beach. I don't really remember a single day where she wasn't either painting a seashell or talking about it or at the beach. And we released our ashes at night. This was highly illegal, by the way. We want that was a public beach that we dumped our ashes. And the wind shifted. And our ashes didn't go in the ocean, but directly into my dad's face. So, she never really got her final wish. She's part of the beach and not the ocean. I guess technically the sand goes back in the ocean, but still. Now, that's, uh, that's more info you guys know about me. That's more terrifying info you guys know about me. She would have hated this music. She never wanted her funerals to be sad. She would have wanted us smiling. She said so. She fought really hard. She was proud of herself. She never gave up. Not once. Yeah, we, we already talked enough. I 
am sorry. I am sorry that you died. Okay, let's get out of here. Why can't we eat the food? I wanna eat the food. Damn freaking emails, I just wanna drink coffee. Coffee. Oh, there's a pacemaker. Okay. Yeah, we'll, we'll take care of it. Wait, there was another... Was there another? Oh, cool. What do I do? What do I... because of the batteries. Ugh. Felt that right in my scar. Right into the neck scar. I know I'm not doing his neck, but it's still, it's close. Uh, I don't like it. I don't like it. talk to all these people so that way everything will be all nicey nice you want to do after that it's pretty nice out let's go find a patio somewhere sounds good i could use a beer right now i would tell you the time we tailgated no we talked a few times but no not really he sounds like a difficult man he was stubborn that's just it stubborn I always told him to quit smoking, but of course he never listened to me. So that figures. Wait, I need to... I need to do this one one time. episode right here. See you guys in the next one. Bye!